What's up guys? Now I'm about to show you how to emulate the Nintendo Virtual Boy. If you know anything about this system, then you know it's Nintendo's forgotten system. And for good reasons. <laughs> but hey, look. It was the first console capable of displaying stereoscopic 3D graphics. The player uses the console like a head mounted display, placing the head against the eyepiece to see a red monochrome display. The games use parallax effect to create the illusion of death. So what happened with this system? Well, sales failed to meet targets, and Nintendo seized distribution and game development in 1996, having released only 22 games for the system. Okay, so this will be an easy quick setup guide, now let's get into it. Alright guys, here we are at emulatorzone.com, the link to this page will be in the description below. And right down here you will see BBGIN, go ahead and click on it. And your download should start. Once it's finished, let's go up to the top three dots in the right, click on downloads, show in folder, we can exit out of the browser, and let's just drag the zip file to the desktop. Exit out. Now let's extract the folder. If you guys need to download 7-zip to extract your files, I will have the link to 7-zip in the description below. Once you have 7-zip downloaded, all you wanna do is right click, go to 7-zip, extract here and you should get three files. We no longer need the zip folder, so we can right click and delete. And you guys can also create a new folder and put these three files in that folder if you would like. Now let's open the emulator. And the only thing we need to set up is our controller. So let's go up to config, input config. Now the emulator will automatically detect your controller you're using. In my case, I'm using an Xbox One controller and you can also use your keyboard. All you want to do is click on the button you're ready to emulate, so we'll click on up, it's going to be highlighted in green, and then we'll just hit the up button on our Xbox One controller, left, down, right, and it'll just go right down the line for you. Go ahead and set that up. And once you're finished, click OK. And that's it. Now we can load up a game. So let's go up to file, open ROM. Locate wherever your ROMs are on your computer. I'm gonna load up Virtual Boy Wario Land. Select the game. And it should start up. Now if you would like to make your screen size bigger, you wanna go up to view, and you can take it up to four times. Thank you guys for watching make sure to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video and make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and i will catch you guys in the next one peace